So, this is sort of the time area. Now, we're gonna explain what happened. Now, this is way back in the day, people used to use cloth for their different things. Now, this cloth was supposed to be strong, but it wasn't as strong as today's. Now, this is this an example of what it used to look like, but this was very, very cold and nice inside. You could keep up all your body temperatures inside of this thing and sleep inside of this on your trampoline, for instance. Now, believe me, I am a little bit cold out here, but still. Now, the early settlers typically used stuff such as orbs. Now, these orbs were able to predict the time. Now, way back, um, maybe around the 1500s, these giant balls of energy, as people called them, were very powerful. Now, people depended on these. Now, they used these tiny things to pick away one chip at a time. Now, one chip at a time, you might think, is very long. They pick it up every year, at the end of every year, which is December 31st. December 31st is a type of year where it's about to turn whatever year. Now, in the 1500s, what they did is, was way different than ours. We did not sell New Year's. Some types of states either celebrated completely different. Like sometimes this state I'm, sure I'm talking about is sometimes a bigger state than ours. Across the world, maybe the Gulf of Mexico. Um, I'm talking like half the states in the America. Now, other sides of the earth have different areas. But what I'm saying is this one used every at December, December 31st. They chipped away one pick every end of the year. Now that is called the time stone. They pick it off with one of these tiny tools. Now you guys can't really see, but I'm about to zoom in. Um, after this, you guys can ask me some fresh questions in the comments. If you guys would like uh, and ask me some questions, I'll be sure to reply and like and heart. So what I'm saying is, this time they picked off every time one tiny stone piece. And the one they picked it off, they have felt happy. Why? Because they were picking off that year. So if they put that in their bedroom, the, that room would turn into their entire year. Now, every year they do this because they thought that there was a type of God. Um, they thought it was a type of God, and for some reason, they did. The one they did, they meant it. You, if you're ever dressed for it, you would be bullied. If you're ever bullied for it, it was crazy. Now, this type of ball, guys, is very hard, and it's very hard to be made. It was made from crystal, and what you do when you pick every single part up every, about every year, you will run out of something, which will be a lot. Now, these things are meant for last. When you run out of all of it out on the outside, you will go inside. When you finish off the inside, which is only about a couple of five years. Now these things are meant to last about 40 to 80 years. Now these things, if you do not pick it off, that means that God does not do anything. Now, typically you have to pick it at the correct time. If it's December 30, it won't work. They think that way back in the day, they thought that this was a Greek God help but then only currently maybe about 1840 they thought wow that is dumb we and then they broke all crystal balls in the area and completely changed them now in the comments you guys can ask questions take pictures of the video and show them what, what they wanted to know this is sort of a prehistoric house behind me. Now, it's only the roof and stuff were outside on the deck. But I'm. this is sort of a area where you typically would lounge. Now, this is a typical, they just called the testing table. And what they would do is, they would, so what, where they would keep the ball is in a container called the glass container. Now, I'm about to zoom in a lot of this. They put the ball inside, and they sort of kept it here all year. Now, what they did, is then at some point people created something to glue the thing down, but they didn't do that. The only people that knew in the God would that bad that them. But half the population just wanted to put it in there because they thought it was a correct way of showing it back. Now what 
the Indian Year, you guys all know, you picked off the types of stones. Yes. Now, the type of stones were very hard to cut. Now, these things were from the inside of the earth. Like, for goodness me, like, it was hard to get. But when they finally got it, it was either by the end of the year, but if someone kept it and never took a piece off, they would be a wall hunter. Now, a wall hunter, you do not want to be named as a wall hunter. That means you do not pick off the type of stone and do not care. Now, picking off the type of stone is very bad to them. Now, we, they also had something like this. Now, this is a type of thing that they use to pick up it. Without we they did not use their hands. They used the, this type of pole. Now, there's one more part that I want to show you. It's over here. Give me one sec. Now, really serious people used this, a type of clear bottle. Now, this bottle, they, in their word, thought that this would be a better way of conducting the experiments. And guess what? They thought this so much that they took advantage of it. Typically, they filled it up to a half gallon of water. Then at the end of the year, they flipped the water. The water would go all over the place. It would cover them. But they thought it would completely help them, the gods, clean themselves. For some reason, they thought that this was real, but honestly, scientists have predicted it. This is not real. There's no Greek god in this, unless you think it is. But now, guys, you guys can now see some, um, a little bit of some tiny things where I'm sure to show you guys. So this is what the full place looks like. Now, I'm sort of going to zoom in on some stuff, but this is the ball of energy that they called it. This is that tiny syringe. So what they did is they picked it. And they, this is the holder where they put it in. Now, these two things are very special for them. This is a thing where they hold it up, so that's it. Time for the next one. That will be really cool. <laughs>